Scones. Mm. I love scones. Holy crap, it was a damn delivery truck. Anyway, the video you're about to watch is interesting. I thought it was important to show a little bit of failure. You know, not every time out on the water is just a hammer fest. You know, so I went out and uh, I, was, I was trying to hunt down my master angler, Minnesota master angler bullhead, brown bullhead. It'd be a... Uh, needed 20 inches and I've come close before my hopes were high but you know it just it didn't pan out and uh, yeah I think it's important to show that kind of stuff so enjoy the video you have a wonderful day I'm in my boat yeah taking a little break from the flow tube deal I just got back from Tennessee like last night I don't know what day you'll see this but you know I was in Tennessee for a little while but we're out here in the brown bear today is gonna be we're gonna hunt down some crappies and then as that sun gets a little lower we're gonna look for some master angler bullheads for Minnesota I'm looking for a 20 inch brown bullhead come close a couple of times we're gonna see if we can make it in the boat with me is always my boy crafty bit off already yeah it happens you know he already said bad words so I'm gonna down this uh, wind is drifting us right into this weed bed I'm gonna reposition the boat so it feels a little weird to drive a boat instead of a float tube but I'll get her figured out I remember how to do it so let's go catch some crappies <laughs> so he's talking right in here is where the bluegill are in the trench in the middle Gilligan's So what we're doing here is we're set up right on the edge of the weed line about like 15 to 16 feet of water using these Northland thumper jigs just kind of slow rolling them along the weed edge Looking for them crappies. Yeah. Yeah, they're literally right below the boat. Ah. Well, you wanna try that gill spot? Yeah. Off the hook. Perch. That was a gill, dude. Was it a gill? Yeah. Ah. That was a nice one. He felt pretty good. Mm -hmm. Ah! Ah! Yeah, we're just we're just drifting. You know, like a little drift over this 14 foot flat between two points. Oh, we're gonna have to do this again. Ooh, got Dang it. Yeah, there's a bunch down there. Oh. There we go. Little guy. The 14 foot bluegill. I'll show you what I'm using. I can get it out of his face. 
Just a 16th ounce head and half a power grub. Here's the deal though. What's the deal? The deal is we celebrate the first bullhead with blueberry scones. I have a question. Hold on. What's up? Who eats blueberry scones in the evening? Who eats a scone in the evening? Isn't that a breakfast item? Boom. Blueberry Blueberry scones. Uh you know what? Uh you know as a human being, you're free to eat whatever you want when you want. Correct, but scones can be enjoyed anytime. Okay. You know? What in in your world that you get fing backhanded house. if you eat pancakes for supper? At grandma's house you can eat scones in the evening. Yeah, but haven't you made pan pancakes for supper? No. Oh really? There you have it. Okay, I'm fishing. Pancakes are different. Guys weird dude. We've set up on what I consider confidence. Literally, I've caught lots of bullheads here. So, it's just gonna be a waiting game until you see. The later it gets into night, the better off we're gonna be. Yeah, time will tell. Oh, this might be. It's acting like one. And he's gone like one. Winner! It was too. He was rolling, yeah. Might get my scope on Oh my god. I think this is it guys. There's some rocking and rolling going on here. Okay, it counts. That is a bullhead. A brown bullet head at that. And it counts. It's got whiskers. Yes. Yeah, I think we should we should definitely move up. Whiskered kittens. Cool looking fish. Got that square tail rounded. I'm getting really tired of this. <laughs> Sorry if it's not morning, you know, I'm sure they taste better in the morning, but. Dang that. That scone though is oh so good. Are you going to eat yours? No, I haven't caught a bullhead. I'm going to eat mine right now. I hope so, bud. Jeez, oh, man. Probably a bad time to ask, but do you still have a little box of hooks? <clears throat> Hang on. I'm going to eat my scone. Pony? Took me in a f***ing salad dude net me yeah, yeah net me dude oh it's scone time yeah you get your scone congratulations i get my scone you did it 
Now, if I, I gotta unhook this little rascal before. There we go. That was easy. Not what we were looking for, size-wise, but it's the right flavor. Nope. Stones. Mm. I love stones. Wow. Okay, I got him. Dang it. <laughs> ah, he got me. Oh, this is not good, dude. Yeah, plus he stabbed me. Oof, that's gonna itch. That's gonna itch tonight. It's already burning. This venom is coursing through my veins. Well, that looks like it's gonna be the end of it. All right, that's it. We're calling it. It's quarter after nine. Could stay out, but dude's gotta work in the morning. I just took a shot in the finger. <clears throat> it's already puffy. I did manage to get my scone. Got two little tiny bullheads. I don't know what's going on. I'm gonna blame 2020. Yeah, everyone yeah. else is. Yeah, it's just squirrely. But it was a beautiful night. I don't know what the next adventure holds. Probably some flow tubing. I love it. It's fun. So until then, be good. Be kind. Later. <laughs>